So today we're jumping off the top of the new Willy T <laughs> and diving into the original one. Yes, I love jumping off of things. Tea is an iconic floating bar and restaurant located in the Bight Bay on Norman Island. But in 2017, during Hurricane Irma, it was completely destroyed. Now, there's a new Willie Tea in its place, and the original one that was destroyed has been sunken off Peter Island. Okay, there's a little bridge, I guess. Let's see a little color change. Yeah. All right, well. Yeah. I think I'll just come in and take this one on the right. We're not totally sure where the wreck actually is, but we do know it is located somewhere off the stern of the boat in 65 feet or 20 meters of water. And that underwater ridge we noticed sailing in is just behind us and should be a good reference point for us to locate the shipwreck. Or at least we hope so. Bit of a current. Okay, yeah. Let's, uh, let's head around to the front, to the bow, and go down the mooring line and uh, see if we can find it from there. Okay, that sounds like a good plan. Taking a moment to inspect the mooring line, we turn off towards the stern of the boat and try to locate the ridge line. We're fairly confident the wreck is somewhere along it, but we're not 100% sure which direction to look. So we decide to head east, keeping the ridge on our left side. But before too long, we decide to turn around and head the opposite direction. Water is a little green and visibility is not the best, but we're hoping to see the shadowy silhouette of the ship in front of us, and we think we've spotted it. But getting closer, it turns out to be just a large coral head. However, swimming over it, we see an ominous figure standing in the distance.
Chained to the sea floor, this skeleton appears to be welcoming us to the wreck site with a bottle of rum. And guides us to the silhouette of the wreck in the distance. Approaching the bow, it's obvious this is no ordinary shipwreck. It's a work of art, submerged by an organization called Beyond the Reef. But more on that later, as we need to focus on the true pirates of the Caribbean dueling just ahead of us. Escaping down the port side, we find the deck is laden with cannon, and her captain is still sitting in place. Over the stern is another ghostly figure, offering something up to us or the wreck. If you know what it is, comment below. Rising back over the stern, we find the ship's wheel and more pirates on deck. Leaving Sarah topside with the pirates, Evan and I decide to inspect the hold and are reminded about what she said earlier. Yes, I love jumping off of things. Because unbeknownst to us, she's being forced to walk the plank. Searching over the side for all we can find is the name of the vessel, Willie T. So Evan and I decide to have some fun and see what the pirates are doing inside. And it looks like they're having a pretty good time. Art reefs like the Willie T have been made possible in the BVI by Beyond the Reef and a lot of volunteer help. The vision of Beyond the Reef is to repurpose hurricane damaged boats like the Willie T, turn
turn them into artificial coral reefs and ask divers for donations when diving the art reef sites. A simple $5 donation goes straight to the local swim programs for BVI kids and can provide future job opportunities. For more information, we've added a link to Beyond the Reefs website in the description below. So like Pirates of the Caribbean, it's, it's a Disneyland ride down there. They're so cool. There are swashbuckling pirates and the soft coral and the little fish around their heads made them look like they had crazy hair. Yeah, they're playing cards, they're doing fun things. <laughs> yeah, the, the life on there is actually pretty cool because the coral as well, and it's, it hasn't really been that long since they sunk in. And see like that much coral growth on it was pretty cool Yeah. As well. So it's definitely serving its purpose. Whoa, current as an artificial reef. <laughs> wow, that picked up. Uh, but anyway, guys, hey, if we can get back on board, check us out in our next video here. We're doing a lot of sailing and diving around the British Virgin Islands. And uh, definitely check out our dives here on the Wreck of the Rhone. All right, we'll see you next time underwater.